This is absolutely amazing. I'm again at another building. We're trying to check out the rooftop restaurant. This is cool. Oh, you know like the Libyan ambassador embassy is here? Yeah. This is cool. Oh my goodness. Just look. Congo will blow your mind, people. Just come with me. Wow. Elevator is a little small. <laughs> like maybe for how many people? Two or three people at a time. But this is so cozy, man. This is cool. <laughs> Let me show you Congo, right? Let us show you Congo. <laughs> oh my God. This is crazy. Look at this restaurant. Oh man. Check out this place. This is dope, y'all. Let's just walk around a little bit and see. This is absolutely amazing. Messi, how are you? This is beautiful. This is my first time here. She just brought me here. I'm like, oh my, what the hell is this? It's more beautiful because everything is closed and the lights is more ready. I'm going to come back here at night. I will. This is amazing. Sure. Thank you. Oh my goodness. Let me just take a look around. Guys, I am telling you, you will not believe what is in this country we call Congo. Just check it out. I think the rooftop is actually probably on the top, or this is it, I don't know. But this is my first time here, and I'm glad it's empty because then I can show you uh, the place. This is totally, totally beautiful. And you have to see what is in this country. And this building, I pass by it every time, didn't even know that they have this. It's right on the Broadway. Absolutely amazing. Have folks, welcome to I am telling you. This is. Guess what? This thing, the, the opening uh -huh. at night, uh -huh. because people they have fresh air. Oh. And then now it's because of sun, that's why they, they close it. Oh air. my god, that is. That's amazing. They have this uh, uh, opening, on, whatever it is, but. The covering and this, yeah, and the guys try to. Oh, you can see some part of it is open. This is crazy. Oh, look at that. The guy is opening it for us. That is amazing, y'all. This is amazing. Don't play with Congo. <laughs> this is crazy. The manager just decided to open it for us to show us that this is how you can get the sky view and everything. Ah, man, I am telling you, folks are gonna love this. Do you know, my name is Lazarian. Yeah, um, my wife is um, Rose. She's from Congo, I'm from Nigeria, but we live in the US. So she got an appointment here. And so she's coming here to work and I'm here to just visit, stay for a while. Yeah, and, and, and thank you. And this place is just blowing my mind. You know, yeah, but we just talk. This place is blowing my mind. I'm telling you. There's honor for us. Because because when you hear Congo abroad, the images that come to your head don't mirror this. You know what I'm saying? So when you come here, you're like, oh my God, this is what you're talking. <laughs> so. Say it again. No, no, I just close this one because it's so sunny for your eyes. Yeah. This is cool. It, there's there's a there's a bar on top. No, we have a setup on top. So okay, like okay. Yeah. Not yet open. Okay. Uh, do like a stand type of thing. Okay. So we'll open it 
Okay, the evenings. This is crazy. This is a must come to in the evening. I'm telling you, yeah. Let's get something to drink or something. Yeah. This is <laughs> babe, why do you like this place? <laughs> Cool. This is cool. I, I'm going crazy. You know, people, you don't know, people just don't understand Congo. You know, I get comments, people say, like, oh yeah, it's just a, a little bit, it's just the 5%, but we'll, let's work on the 5%. Okay? From 5%, we we'll go to 10, to 20, to 30, to 40, to 50. That's how people develop. Let's not knock development. I want development. I want development for Congo, for all of Africa. You know, so see things like this, it just it just makes me. You can you can you can just hold it for me. Let me talk a little bit because I really want to get some people. When you see things like this, and you're you're a positive thinking person, it, it has to hit you. You know, I understand the entire Congo is not like this. We know that. We don't need to be reminded about that. Every Congolese knows the situation is wrong. But what I'm trying to do is I'm trying to show how the pets that are being taken right now, where they are living. You understand? That is what I want to show. I want to show people that yeah, it's possible to come here and do business. It is, it is very possible to do these things uh, here in Africa, particularly in Congo. If these people were not making money, they wouldn't be in business. You know, they will not be in business. So it's 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 good that people see stuff like this, encourages them. And I know that the diaspora have capabilities. You know, I always say that people think I'm joking. No, I know diaspora. I know Congolese diaspora. I know African, Nigerian, you know, Ghanaian, Senegalese, Kenyans, uh, these people. I know them. There are Kenyans in America that are billionaires. And we're trying to get them to come and invest here. There are African Americans that are looking for places to invest and call home. This is the heart of Africa, y'all. This country is bordered by nine different countries. How, how, how good can you get? So, this is a message to you. I'm showing you to, this to be a positive message, not to uh, cause any kind of whatever. But let us just come. Come here and see. And to the diaspora, take us to go away on how we are to join this kind of thing. These are good examples of being set. So let's emulate them. Thank you very much. We'll show you the rest of this thing as we go. Uh, let them give us some drink. Let's order some. <laughs> We come from America, you know. Mm. So we look like crazy people from Congo. Yeah. But I'm from Congo. I've been here, I've been in America for 15 years. So when you go back, people are looking like you like yeah, they mm. so over here to they, be in the first time for the staff here in Congo is something like what was that? Yeah. So when they close yourself, it's completely amazing. Exactly. Yes. Because in these four years for me here, I don't feel that it's nothing here. <laughs> Not like that. Mm -hmm. I feel like okay, it's been more welcome because mm -hmm. also people they don't appear about Congo. Yeah, they have no idea. They don't have their publications. Exactly. They don't marketing much. They're not the posting the pay in all the countries. So exactly. Yeah. And if you compare to Dubai, to be exposed to people, so boosting a lot. Exactly. Yeah. Over here they don't do that. Yeah. Exactly. So the problem is that exactly. they are doing. They want to do something different, which here is perfect. Yeah. Yeah, but it's important that people know. The reason you go to Dubai, the reason I went to Dubai was because people told me about Dubai. They said, yeah, you gotta go to Dubai. The communication over here is very low. It's very low. And because they don't like to expose themselves. Exactly. Yeah. They belong to politician families. Yes. You got it. On the news. Yeah. Everybody was quiet. Yeah. That's the problem we have when you get this like that and mm. it's your phone, mm. everybody's mad because uh, they'll be on camera. But yeah. they don't know, we don't need the people, we want to show I want the environment. I don't disclose who owns what. It's not my business, yeah. They have what they have. Yes. They have a good quality, they have the published diamonds, a lot of things. Yes. People don't say that. But they are so quick to talk about how bad. You know, people just say, oh, it's war. They're killing each other. They're this. 
their names. Yeah. Mm -hmm. It likes the wrong reason. Yeah. That's right. Yeah. We get relation to whoever in the high level position politics, they don't speak much. Yeah. They don't express with the cameras. Yes. They think that they're revolutionary. Exactly. They come from. Yeah. That is why yeah. me, I don't talk about who owns what. It's not yeah. my business. Yeah. I'm just trying to show yes. what is here. I'm trying to tell people, come and visit. And don't be afraid of being killed. Nobody's killing you. You know, there are good people living here. They are very educated people. They are studies from good family and they have high position. The problem is that they don't like to stream yourself with the camera and TV. I know. Because they think that their profile will attach with their and it's going to be more problem for them. For them, yeah. And they don't like to take pictures. I know, oh my god, I've never seen people more camera shots. But you know, it's gonna go away because you don't understand, these people have been under some very strict conditions before. Okay. Now you have democracy. Everything is losing that. Someone told me, oh, they're gonna arrest you, so who's gonna arrest you? Yes. You can't arrest me. Right <laughs> yes. Yeah. Yeah. So uh -huh. they, they just arrest people these days, you know? So the rights are there, come in, let us go with yes. you know? I go to the mall. Beautiful places, but no customers. And I'm like, I'm from the US. You enter the mall, it's like a, you know, busy place. And I'm like, how do you sell? I told the people, how do you sell? Okay, you say you have 40% off. How do people know that you have 40%? Things that most of the shops in the malls, they are doing the marketing. Yeah. They make the contacts and yeah. they visit their places to save. Yeah. That's how they do it. But over here, the people, minus probably of the people mentality of Yeah. They are in the high class yeah. Middle class will run for that. Yeah. They try to craft that. Okay. And wow. the main problem is the chicken. <laughs> I see a lot of my phones from because of them. Yeah, you see? Oh man, but that's you know... it. Because of race stealing and the people mm. see that you okay, you are high quality and high class, mm. middle will come, oh hello, hello, hello. And they run with their pictures, and yeah. photos and put yeah. on his profile picture. Uh, that's yeah, yeah. that's yeah. the thing. You know? It's true. That's why. The big, most know, of the people, most of the good families, mm -hmm. they only dining there where they can comfortable to not someone will come to disturb their tables. Exactly. And over here we got very good clients, that's good. But we respect yeah. them, yeah. and over here everyone respects oh, them. I, I agree. I agree. That's why I always tell them, I say, let's go to restaurant when it's not full. In that way, they're very scanty people. Over here, over here we have uh, the lunch time. We do the. The offices, okay. and we have which have banked as well. Okay. Whatever they want, take away, they can have it. Take okay. out most of the time because the lunch is office. not moving well because it's a lounge at night. Yes. The crowd will come. Yeah. Evening is the main thing. Yeah. But well, I'm going to okay. come here in the evening though Perfect. because Thank this is going to be a good so view. Thank, Thank you. you. I appreciate you. Thank you. Let's watch this guy as he fixes drinks. Oh my God. I was kind of late, right? Is that our? Wow! <laughs> that is Kitoko. <laughs> yeah, man. Check that out. What is it, anyways? I'm the before man. This before people need to pay me for 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 advertising their beer like this, right? Yeah? We need to talk with them. Uh, what is it? That's what a is cocktail it? mixed with some um, whiskey. The whiskey. Uh, pineapple uh -huh. and, uh, and the final name is Madison. Mad Madison March. Madison what? March. Madison March. Okay, cool. That is that's something. Is that on the on the thing? Let me see. Let me see what the menu looks like. Because people want to see that from very far. Madison March. Oh, that was that's the drink we got. That is so cool, guys. You see what they, they get? This is a cocktail menu here. Man, come to Kinshasa, people. Come to Kinshasa and see what we got. This is just their menu. And then they have a New Year's Eve celebration menu. This is 2022. New Year's menu at the K Lounge. Let me see the inside and let's show you what's in there. Voila! This, this is what we are talking about. 
I want you to just view and see. This is what we are talking about. That's what, this is what we are talking about. That's my beer. Uh, take that. Thank you. Merci, Papa. This is good. I'm the buff. Yeah, man. I'm the performer. Just look at that. Look at that. Look at that action. This is what I'm talking about, people. Yeah. Warm weather. <laughs> champagne, right? Israel guys is really like champagne. This is what I'm talking about. We have warm weather. It's beautiful to be out here. And yeah. So today I'm just jumping from rooftop to rooftop. So all I'm gonna do is uh, That's what I'm talking about. That's what coming to Kinshasa for. I hope you guys are enjoying this though. The thing is good, eh? <laughs> but it's got it's got what is it? Um, whiskey. Nah, whiskey is too much for me. This one and the other one, which is better, that one with the leaves and everything. No, that one. <laughs> but I see land because it's a yeah. natural fruit. Uh -huh. You get juice from pineapple. That is so cool. I mentioned that I'm done with the box one. Uh -huh. And I think that I will press the natural fruit. The press the juice. Yes. Wow. This is what I'm it's talking so about. Oh, oh, that is oh, cool. Oh. And that's the master mixer over there. <laughs> you just gotta love these people. I'm telling you. You gotta love them. Look at drinks. You haven't seen nothing. Come to Congo and I'll show you what they got. Look at that. Look at that. Check out drinks. Things. You haven't seen nothing. Come to Congo and I'll show you what they got. Look at that. Look at that. Check out drinks. Now this, <laughs> this is a beautiful view, I'm telling you. This is what I'm talking about. Check out Kinshasa, people. Sorry. Check out Kinshasa. This is, oh my God. This is beautiful. Wow. Check out these buildings, though. It is going out. I told you guys, this city is on the move. These are the signs of a, a great city on the move. Look at these constructions. This will blow your mind. You know how many stories up we are? This will blow your mind. All right. This is amazing. Check out the view. Bonjour. <laughs> Check out the view. This is Kinshasa, yo. This is what I'm talking about. Look at the city. This is a blow your mind. Look at apart. Look at those. Uh, I know uh, apartments and some government offices on that side. But the 
DG whatever it is okay but check out my city check it out this is what I'm talking about now people are quick to tell you ah Kishasa Congo is this Congo is that they don't show you this part of Congo See, you will never see this on CNN. I guarantee you that. But I got to bring this to you. That's Fachi over there taking his COVID vaccination. So for those of you who need convincing, there's a big boss over there taking his own. That's to encourage people to go out there and take their shots. But look at the incredible views of here. I can see my little car parked by the side of that. This is humongous, people. This is totally, totally mind blowing. That's the boulevard. And just look at it. Look at Kinshasa. Look at Kinshasa. So, for those people who are saying, ah, no, no, I said, you need more convincing that the city is moving. No? Let's come here and join these people. Look at construction. Look at that. This is a building that is God knows how many stories are going in the air. But so just look at it. Look at the people working. You see Congolese working. You you think you have the skills? Check in there. You can look in there. They are Congolese working. All they are looking for is opportunity to work. The labor is here. The manpower is here. The intelligence is here. You will not believe the engineers that are here that are Congolese working. I see them in action every day. In road construction, building construction. They are everywhere. I know some of them. You have no idea how many people I know in this town right now. So, when I say... It's time, people. Believe me. Believe me. Hear my call. Every Congolese diaspora who has the capacity come to Congo and visit in this 2022. You will thank me years later. Come to Congo. Find a way, I know. Find a way. Just come in to do fact-finding. Just say, oh, this guy has been talking, talking. Let me go and check. Just come. I welcome you. And if you hit the city, give me a buzz. You know, tell me where you are. And I'll find you. I'll meet up with you. I'll be glad to meet up with you. You know. I'll be glad to meet up with you. And and, and we can go around the city together. Okay? It is important that we hear this call. This is a call of our lives. We cannot sit back there and watch a Dubai being created. This is this is gonna be and I'm saying this without reservation. This is going to be the best country in Africa when it is fully unleashed. It's the richest country in the world. It has all the mineral resources. It has the people. Nature is on our side. So, I hope you guys enjoy this. Look at how small the buses are from the height that I'm shooting from. That's what I'm talking about. Congoli brothers and sisters, be proud of what you got. I am proud for you. Thank you so much. God bless you all. That was breathtaking. Absolutely breathtaking. Absolutely. That was a fantastic place we went. We're just downstairs now. This is nice, you know? But that building there is a monster. A complete monster. Like this. This is what we're talking about. Just check out.
check out the walls. It's Congolese. Eh? They, they know how to make you. Just check out the, the walls of the entrance. Beautiful. Absolutely. It's amazing. Now let me show you this building where the wall on top. This is what I call monstrosity. This is happening right now, yo. They knocked what was there down and they're building that. So this whole place is a construction site right now. This is the boulevard right here. This is what we're talking about. This is what we are talking about. It is nice, breezy. It looks like it's going to rain, but the weather is fantastic, yo. I mean, what can you say? This is this is Kinshasa. You gotta love this town. You gotta love this town. Where is he? <laughs> Call his phone. Yeah, the driver has stepped out of the car. That's all good. But it's a well, folks. I want to thank you all for joining us on this adventure i hope you enjoyed it as much as i did producing it this is really eye-opening for me in this city thank you and please i want to plead with you once again if you have not subscribed to our channel please give us a subscription as we really need them badly thank you for watching and god bless you all